Shea Bear 1000 here. Today, we're gonna check this old fire extinguisher out and see if it works. And then I'll probably be drilling a hole into it and uh, turn it into a gas tank for my old tractor, so. But first, I'm just kinda curious, will it work? Let's check it out and see. Okay guys, so this is a water or steam. You can put steam in here or water. Um, it sounds like it, and feels like it may have uh, some water in it. But, um, the gauge is not showing no pressure. So, let's take this off of here. A little bit of pressure in it. You know what? Let's try to put some air in that thing and see if it'll shoot out any water. Okay, I got my air hose here. Now this thing, this tank is tested to 500 PSI. We're not gonna be doing that. <laughs> Just checking to see if the gauge is moving any. I don't know if it's getting any air put into it or not. Sounds like it. Of course the gas tank it won't have to be pressurized yeah it's getting some air in it oh yeah okay well all right let's pull this pin oh <laughs> it still works Wow, it is a two and a half gallon tank. Um, I've seen one identical to this online. They're claiming it's a 1968. So I'm gonna go with that for now. I don't know if that's right or not. If you guys know, let me know, please. There it goes. See, the handle does have a little leak up here. But like I said, we're not going to be worrying about that. That's pretty cool. And I think it'll clean up nice. Okay, so there's no more pressure in it. Okay, so you tighten it this way. So it's got to untighten this way. So, let me see. I don't have a wrench that big or anything that big that kind of ashamed to be drilling holes in this thing. Yeah, that's a uh, Yeah, it's stainless steel inside there too. Sometimes they got a, this is a, a casing, but this is the actual tank. So let's get some water. We'll put some more water in here and get some more air in it. Let's do that again. That was pretty fun. Okay. Now, Let's screw this puppy back on here. That's pretty cool. This is a Class A. This is for Class A fires. Uh, what that means is 
like you know wood and stuff like that grass you know just regular combustibles paper you know stuff like that that's what a class a fire is this is a class a fire extinguisher so chisel here that should do it now let's put some more air in it That's this thing, it never does right. There we go. And the gauge is working. All right. Now, let's squirt some water. This is kind of cool. Kind of heavy though. Wow, there's your super soaker, guys. <laughs> Check this out. About three fourths of the weight of the woods over there. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Oh no. There's a fire. Whatever will we do? Never fear, guys. Shea Bear's here. <laughs> well, now I gotta pick that up. Okay, guys, there it is. It's, uh,. It's functional. It works. I think it'll clean up really nice. But I brought Monkey out and did the same thing with her. I had a little fire going and showed her how far to spray. Now, I only put about 50 pounds of water in there, or 50 pounds of air in that thing, so it'd probably shoot farther than that. And you've seen the power it had. She came up with an idea. Monkey said, you know, we keep. You know, when we have our fires out back, we can set that out back with us. That's a great idea, because remember my campfire? My campfire fire? <laughs> when I burnt my campsite down? Uh, <laughs> yeah, your okay. <laughs> went in the house to get stuff, and I came back out to this. Yeah, so that would be really cool. Um, I mean, it is functional. I think it'd clean up pretty cool. It's just a nice piece to have around so maybe I won't be drilling any holes in that thing we'll just have to see if it was kind of beat up and stuff or scratched up and dinged up sure but I don't know she's got the right idea though so anyway guys just thought we'd check this out together and you know I bring it along with me see if it worked so that's pretty cool because you know there's seals and stuff in here so and you can put steam in it you know hot water and stuff and uh you know, or not stuff, but you can put pressurized steam in there. So that's pretty cool. That's something to think about, you know, steam cleaning something. You know, I could boil some water, dump it in there, shoot some air in it. Steam clean motors or something. I don't know. The possibilities are endless, guys. Shea Bear, the myth, the man, the legend. I'm out of here for now. We'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye, guys, and take care.